Hello everyone, this is Joel from Cannon Coffee and today we have a Rocket Departmental with us in the shop. Now, we did quite a few uh, things on this machine. One, uh, the machine was slightly overheating so we replaced it with the brand new Rocket Departmental uh, pressure set. Also with the modification to uh, help stabilize it even more. As you can see, kind of, um, it will not go past that 1.2, 1.1. Very, very stable machine now with that new pressure set. Also, we replaced the pump because after we did all the work to this machine, which I'll get to the rest in a second, um, the pump was only getting to around six bars and then it'll completely turn off. So it just signs that your pump was dying out. So we replaced that with a new pump. Did a complete tune-up um, on your group head, which is back flushing. Um, also descaling, replaced both the gasket and the shower screen. Sadly, this came with a silicone gasket, but usually we would typically reuse them because silicone gaskets are great. But, as you can see from the wear of it, it is really in rough shape. Also, your group head is in really rough shape. Um, so we replaced it with brand new ones. We don't have, sadly, we don't have silicone gaskets here. We have the normal ones, and so that's what's inside here with a spacer to make sure that your port filter gets to that. Uh, 90 degree. Also, we replaced. Also, we replaced both the knob assemblies. So I have all the original parts here. So, as I was saying, that pump here is right here. Um, this is the older pressure stat um, that the apartmentos come with. And then we replaced both of these. So what these are is your valves that stick here that stop your machine from pouring hot water, pouring steam when, you know, it's close completely. But as you can see from the top, kind of hard to see. These are meant to be completely flat. Um, the O-rings on them or the spacers, uh, there you go, are completely worn through. So this is the one that was on the steam one that was completely leaking when it was pressurized, as you can see. And so uh, we replaced both of them on both sides. And yeah, so it's running well, it's not leaking at all. And that's about it. Also, a lot of there's a lot of buildup in your lower valve, so I had to clean it by hand, but that's besides the point. Um, yeah, so we're gonna test the machine. We have your port filter here. We did deep clean your port filter, deep cleaned your steam wand. And so we are going to make a shot. And since this is a new gasket, uh, don't worry if it feels a little too stiff. Um, that's what usually what happens, and the more you wear into it, the more you use it, the more looser it'll get, and you'll get to that night. We're gonna pour a shot. I didn't calibrate our uh, coffee to your machine, so don't worry if it runs a little too fast, a little too slow. Um, we're just making sure water gets to the group head. As you can see, working well. Now we're gonna test the hot water, or oh, we're gonna test the steam on first. A little bit of water comes out. It's very, very powerful. Very, very good steam on. Cool. And then the last function of the machine, we're gonna just pour a little bit of hot water out. I'll pour it outside here. I'm not gonna open it all the way, but as you can see, hot water coming out. And that's about it for this repair. If you like this video or any of our other videos on our channel, leave a like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Thanks for watching.